This is a short video to check whether the high power jump starter power station still works a year after it was last charged up. Now, my car has been sitting idle for most of the time and the battery is flat again, so it's the perfect time to test whether the power station still works. Firstly, I'm checking the charge on the device by pressing on the black power button. It shows three out of four LED lights, so it's lost some charge. Let's see if it's enough charge to jump start the car. I should have watched my original instructional video before doing this because I should have attached the red and black terminals first and then plugged them into the power device, but I managed to get them on safely. Now the power has been sent from the device to the car, so we should be able to start it up. The beeping sound and the display lights are a good indication that we're getting power, so let's try turning the key. Okay, it's working again. Geez, that turned over very easily. But the most important thing is, is it didn't need four LED lights worth of charge to start it up. So based on these findings, I have to say this is a very handy device that still works after storing it for a year without charging. So what's my thoughts on the device now? Well, it's done what they claimed it would do. So I'd have to say this was a good purchase, especially if it means that it saves me from being stuck somewhere with a flat battery and it can sit in the trunk of my car for a year and it's still okay. If you'd like to see the original video on the unboxing and instructions, I'll leave a link in the description. Otherwise, thanks for watching this long. I hope the video helps. If it does, please like and subscribe and help my little channel out.